You know, on a morning like this, I don't even mind the traffic noise. Though I prefer the sound of the river. The Bow River is finally waking up after its long winter slumber. And it's about time. Yeah, there's still lots of ice around, but it's melting fast, and the river itself is just flowing along. The first morning I went out, bright and early, it was a little bit foggy, but that burned off quickly, and along the bow, things were waking up. Well, mostly waking up. This pelican still seemed to be a bit sleepy. And the cormorants and blue herons, they were just getting started with their day. The geese, of course, were making as much noise as possible. But this little guy, he was just singing. A bit further up the river, I found this curious mule deer. And where a tiny creek joins an old floodwater channel, a beaver had built a dam, and this pair of mallards was paddling along. Just upstream from them, a blue heron was watching for frogs, fish, whatever was moving. And muleys further up the coulee were munching on willows. The next time I went out, I found this guy, a young porcupine. He really seemed to like those poplar buds. And then down by the river, I stopped to watch the ice melt. It is a lot warmer than it has been for, well, a very long time. And probably by the time you guys are watching this, most of this ice will be gone. And there will be a lot more insects around than just these little midges. No, they're not mosquitoes, they're midges. Trout love them. It wasn't more than two weeks ago that all of this water was covered with ice. Those pelicans, they were still further south. Same with the cormorants. This loon, well, they don't stay very long, just passing through, but I haven't seen one since last fall. And as far as April showers go, well, um, it's May. Though the crocuses should be in bloom right here, all I could find was wild onions. But you know, that's just fine. Because it's springtime on the bow, and the river runs again. <laughs> 